welcome back to my channel, Crafty Maisha. And today I am making kinetic sand slime with my little brother. Hey guys, Daniel. Before we get started, make sure that you guys subscribe to our new gaming channel, which is called the Crafty Gaming. Um, the link will be in the description. Yep. So let's get, get started. started. All right, guys. Before we start making the slime, here's the ingredients. So you will need a uh, clear glue or a crazy art washable scroll glue. You can also use some borax or activator. Uh, you can also use some uh food colorings or dye. I have red, yellow, pink, purple, and blue. But also the main thing which you need to make kinetic sand slime is the sand, obviously. So now let's get started in making our slime. All right, guys. So the first step to make this slime is to get a bowl, which I have right here, and your spoon. And now it's time to add the glue. So you're going to add, like in my fluffy slime video, you're going to add about how much you're going. You're supposed to add, uh, like how much glue you want your slime to be. So if you add like a little bit of glue, that's how big your slime is going to be. But anyway, so I am pouring my glue in. Okay, all done. So uh. Let me just screw the lid on so that it won't dry out. So here is my glue. All right. So um, here is my bowl. I have mixed in my slime, but now you are going to need three small cups of water. But since I do not add a lot of glue, I'm just adding like one, one and a half cup. Of glue, so yeah. Let me go get the water, and I will see you guys when I do that. All right, guys. So after you're done adding your water, it's time to mix it. So I'll see you guys after I do that. All right, guys. So basically, um, now it's time to add the activator. Well, you guys can also use borax, but I choose activator. So just add a little bit first, and then add and then stir it, and then add a little bit more and then stir it again. Except if you're making kinetic sand slime, you have to leave the slime a little bit more sticky. So yeah. All right, guys. So I added a little bit of activator. So this is how it's going. It's a pretty nice texture, except very sticky. So I think I'm gonna add a little bit more activator. But I want it to be a little bit sticky even after I add the activator. So here is my sign right now. That's the whole thing. So um. I'm going to empty it onto the table just so I can see it all, and it'll be way easier to mold it. I mean, not mold it, but uh, make form it into slime. So um, that's what I'm going to be doing. And wow, it is my hands feel like that they have been put inside glue, even though this is glue with activator though. So yeah. All right, guys. So now I'm trying to form it into slime.
All right, guys. So, um, I have kind of like situated my sign right now. It's a pretty good texture. Uh, it's not that much rippy, but I you could say that it's kind of rippy. Uh, it's really stretchy, but like I said before, it's also very rippy. Um, I really like the texture, and I just found a black thing. On my sign. I don't know if there's any more of those, but now. Alrighty, guys, so here's my sign. As you saw, like, maybe a few seconds ago. But um, now it's finally time for the final step to make kinetic sand slime. And the last step is adding sand. To make it kinetic, obviously. So I have my sand. You can do. You can use any sand which you guys would like. I'm just using this since it is the one which I have. But you are going to take a spoonful, maybe. I got this little spoon right over here. It has a back, so uh, I'm taking two. But if you guys really love the kinetic sand texture, you can actually add three scoops. Or as much as you guys would like, but I'm just saying that if you guys don't know what to pick, you can do two, just like me. But anyways, I am going to. You guys can either put one、uh, spoon of sand in first and then mix it, or you can add two spoons of sand and then mix it. But I am just doing it right now. Because I just rewind to see the sand. So, anyways, now I'm going to mix it. And let me just grab the last spots. And the and my second scoop. So now let me put that in. Wow, that looks like ice cream. It reminds me of it. But anyways, I'm going to squish it. Oh wow, that was that was my hands felt really nice. Wow, can you guys see that? Isn't that so cool? All right, guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure that you guys subscribe, leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and turn on those notifications bell. I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.